Hello and welcome to this YouTube channel guys. I'm Abhishek Pandya and uh, today we will see the layout of the inverter that we have designed. How can we test it? How can we simulate it? And how can we check the functionality? Basically, I will show how to use IRSIM and NGSPICE and how to test the devices uh, that we have designed. So let's start it without wasting any time. So basically, first of all, the design that we have designed, this is in, uh, we have to store it. Uh, I'm storing it with this name INV. Okay, so see this is the file. Okay, so if you can see the dot mag file is generated, right? If you extract it like this, this INV dot ext file is generated, right? Uh, now uh, you can do it to you can do two things here. First of all, you can extract into same file. Okay, so if you do this, same file will be generated. Inv dot same, and you can do this as well. Spice file also you can generate. So this is a spice file that is generated, right? So inv dot uh, mag is the uh, layout. This is extracted file. This is ir. This is same file, and this is spice file. Okay. So if you can just uh, uh, can open it like this, and you can see what are the contents present inside it. Right, so this is the content content present inside it. Ground input VDD. Right, so these are the input things. Uh, you can also uh, go for IR sim. So basically, sim file. So this is sim file. Right. So these are the different things present in the layout. Okay. So what is that open? Basically, what we have to do here, we have to write first the step size that uh, we want to design. Right. So step size of ten is just fine. Okay. Now press W in and out these are the two things you want to read you want to watch right so in and out this is the two things then what you can do you can just go here l and we as we have only one input you can go uh, and write l in okay so it will make input zero okay now uh, if you want to see uh, basically that what are the displays the result are there so you can press uh, d which will give x x and then you can go like s okay so here, what happened? The display was then this is simulate. Okay. So basically, input was zero. You set an input as zero. So what you got output as one, right? Now you can change. Uh, so this is an inverter, right? So the functionality is verified. Uh, you can write H in, and if you press S, you will change. You will see that input is now one, output is zero. So what we wanted is achieved. Uh, now, we, if you want to see in the waveform for like waveform, so how will you see it? See, A and A, and uh, you can just press in and out. Okay, so this will be this thing. Okay, see this carefully. So input was uh, we have set input as low, so this is low. The output became one, and when we set uh, our input as one, output became zero. So this is the functionality verification in the IRSM now let's go for checking the functionality verification in ng spice right, so let's open the terminal here i uh, already open terminal here so basically now uh, you have to go through this steps first of all uh, so you have to make a spice file to check this uh, that whether this uh, design that we have created is correct or not and this are the syntax for the spice file so i have made this file inv check dot spice so just quickly go through it. Uh, this is the file which uh, we have made for checking the functionality. So uh, spice three file created from inv.ext. So file we have extracted a file, right? So in that uh, this is the inv.ext file. SCMOS also technology. These are the Sanders syntax uh, and uh, for making that PMOS, BFAT and NFAT. This is the, these are the names of them and uh, these are the different parameters right so for the first uh, first one we have this we have same w by l ratios see l, uh, w by l ratio is same four here and these are the standard values and these are the input and capacitance capacitance values for the output input and ground so these are that and this is the input uh, we are we want to input these pulse right so this is the pulse we are going to we are going to implement as it is 180 nanometer technology 0 to 1.8 volts will be there and we want to simulate uh, this in the transient view right so we want we want to simulate it for 200 microseconds and uh, this are this is the spice file this is the command which will plot the input and output okay 
so these are the standard syntax you will find it uh, on internet and so let's start with these improvements right so this is the command ng spice the name of the file right try and reach out the spice so if you click on it yep so first of all if you see here you will find different things here so basically that file is created right so that is it output is 1.8 volt input 0 vdd v in branch and this things okay so if you see the graph this is a very important thing right this is the graph of the design if you check this this is red line is input okay so this is the input and blue line uh, represents output so basically this is the output okay so it is complementary right so you can see uh, when this is uh, one this is zero this is z uh, this is uh, when the output is one this is in this input is zero so basically complementary there are some overshoots here here and there but uh, so on and on this is the design you can see input and outputs and uh, as the way as we expected 0 to 1.8 and complementary to that is our output 200 microseconds uh basically this is a simulating so this is how we can check the functionality of the design and this is how you can use ng spice and uh, ng spice and irsim so that was the video guys i hope uh, you understood something and you found some value from this video and if you like if you found it interesting uh, then you can share it uh, subscribe to my channel and uh, i will come up with more and more videos and uh, thank you and happy learning